Hi, I'm State Senator Trace McCreary. Thanks for tuning in for another weekly update. First of all, I want to say congratulations to the Kansas City Chiefs for winning uh, their second in a row Super Bowl. They continue their streak of being the world champions in football and just want to say how proud Missouri is that the Kansas City Chiefs call Missouri their home. Uh, this is, was a short week in the Missouri legislature. Uh, both chambers are either doing technical sessions or the Senate adjourned until Monday so that folks could go and participate in uh, the, cel the Super Bowl parade and celebrations in Kansas City. Um, on Monday, I had a hearing for Senate Bill 822. It's called the Senior Citizen Property Tax Relief Credit but our constituents and a lot of us in this building call it the circuit breaker. The legislation that I filed that you're looking at this afternoon will give seniors and folks with disabilities more immediate relief from property taxes so they can stay in their homes and communities longer. This is a tax credit that's been in existence since 1973, um, but unfortunately the numbers have not been updated in 15 years. And so what I'm trying to do with this bill is adjust the income limit up a little bit and bump the tax credit up a little bit. Uh, we have a lot of seniors around the state and people with disabilities that need immediate property tax relief. And this circuit breaker tax credit can really help people stay in their homes longer and stay in the communities where they feel most comfortable. So uh, I will keep you posted on that. I'm uh, hopeful that it will uh, keep moving through the process as we head towards mid-May. This week on the Senate floor, the Senate Democrats filibustered a, an SJR that would take away the one-person, one-vote process uh, that we use to amend our state's constitution. The Republicans are pushing SJR 74, which would allow a small minority of voters to block what a majority of Missouri voters want to see get approved. Uh, basically, this plan that the Republicans are pushing would end majority rule in Missouri and shred our Constitution. So I assume we're going to get back to that work when, when the Senate gathers on Monday. And just please know that the Democrats are going to do whatever it takes to stand up for democracy. Thanks for tuning in this week, and please keep in touch. And I'll talk to you next week.